George Gunkelman, Monroe Township. I, I don't want to talk about the law, so the attorney can rest for a moment here. But I would like to talk about perception. There are only a few opportunities. There are only a few opportunities that the population of Monroe gets to interact with our school. One is when we have school board elections. Obviously, in this case, um, there was no opportunity to have a, a group of candidates present themselves. But you managed to do it in a way where no, no candidates were able to represent themselves to the public. So we go from a position where it's everyone gets to vote to a position where no one gets to vote and there is no public viewing of the process at all. It was done in closed session. So when you come back to us after there's been the loss of a referendum and weep about why the public is not supporting you, think about it. Because you don't provide that transparency that you claim to foster, you've bypassed it. And you've bypassed the community's right to have a say in it. And then you're surprised by how they react when they do get an opportunity. And it's not a vote of confidence. And now you've moved the election to April, or May, I forget which. And you know that a very small percentage of the public is going to vote at that time. It, it's just, we need to get community support. It seems that you're doing everything possible to, to get rid of it. And it's just a tragedy. And it, you know, a lot of us vote even when we're unhappy with the proposals just because we want to support the school and the, the education they get. But you're not helping us do that. Thank you.